This is Marcus Winkelhock. He only ever did one Formula 1 race, and I'd argue he had the most insane debut of all time. He took part in the 2007 European Grand Prix at the Nürburgring for the lowly Spiker team. He qualified last for the race, but as the cars came round to finish the formation lap, rain started to fall on the track, so the team made the inspired call to box him and put him on some intermediate tyres as the race was starting. Then, carnage ensued. A huge downpour meant that by the end of lap 1, most of the field was having a box for intermediate tyres. Kimi Raikkonen, who went on to win the world title that year, missed the pit lane entry, and by halfway round lap two, Winklehock had taken the lead of the race. Six cars then went off the road down at turn one, causing the race to be red flagged, so he took the restart from the lead, making him the only driver to start last and first in the same Formula One race. Unfortunately, he fell backwards off the restart and later retired due to a mechanical failure from the race, but when people ask me who had the craziest F1 debut of all time, I said, 